What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we're going to talk about the market crash. We're going to talk about some cards you should be sniping, all that good stuff. So before we get into the video, man, um, more likes we do, more likes we get on this video equals more giveaways on Twitter. And not only that, we are buying and selling MT on Twitter and Instagram. So make sure to go follow those socials down below. If you don't have Twitter and or Instagram, you should definitely go get those social apps because they're very good for 2K. And uh, yeah, man. So we are trying to snipe. Some things I'm trying to snipe, man, is Amethyst 20. I missed two curries so far. Uh, make that three curries. One for 21K, one for 20K, and one for 19K. So Amethyst 20 filter right now is definitely going to make you a lot of MT. Oh, that's a good snipe. Yes, sir. Um, Amethyst 20 is probably going to be one of the best filters right now in the game. Um... I would definitely recommend you guys try this out. They're getting cheaper and cheaper as the days go on. If you guys want, you could do Lakers, you could do Bucks, you could do Curry. Just keep scoping out those filters. Because right now, man, is the money time for Amethyst 20s. It's definitely a great time to invest. And uh, not only that, if you guys don't know what the limited requirements are, here's pretty much my limited squad I'm running for the week. And it's honestly pretty solid. Um, I'm going to show you the limited requirements and then we're going to get into some more markets. So it must include three players, Ruby or higher, who have won the postseason NBA awards in their career. So pretty much it's three go three or best players and then all their players must be gold or below. So pretty interesting. Um, so let's go over some cards I think are going to go up, some investments. Uh, we got Kristaps Porzingis, man. I think this card's going to go up in value, okay? Um, this car, ooh, give me that. Yes, sir. 33K for Kristaps. Um, in my opinion, man, Kristaps is the only stretch center in the game, okay? So he's going to change the game big time, okay? So in my opinion, definitely, definitely pick up Kristaps Porzingis because um, that's definitely a good move. Because Kristaps Porzingis is the only stretch center in the game. I definitely think his value does rise up. Another card I ended up sniping today for around 75,000 MT was Kobe Bryant, okay? I picked up this card because if I get him for 75K MT, I think I'm definitely gonna sell him for 100K plus. So I ended up scooping Kobe. Uh, if you want, you should definitely monitor his price and whatnot. Um, next filter, man, we got Kevin Durant, okay? Um, Kevin Durant, honestly, let's check his price. Um, Durant's definitely gonna go up in value. I mean, definitely gonna be a couple snipes up there on Durant. I actually just missed one on PS4. He's going for 250,000 MT. Not only that, he's usable for limited. So if you guys want, I would definitely recommend trying to snipe him out. If you do get this snipe, man, you're gonna make 100,000 MT plus. This card is very, very, very valuable. So definitely try that out. And uh, not only that, we do have Brandon Roy. Honestly, you could just go pink diamond filter. Um, we got Manu Ginobili and Brandon Roy up on there. So if I were you, man, Brandon Roy, okay, um, he's an insane player, okay? This card's stacked. Not only that, man, if you could pair him up with Manu, you're not going to lose any games online, man. Manu and Brandon Roy. So if you guys want, you could go Pink Diamond Refresh. Maybe you get a Brandon Roy, even if you get Manu. I know Manu on PS4 is a buyout. But if I were you, man, I would definitely scope out Manu Ginobili. You know why? Because Manu Ginobili is going to rise up in price. He's in the idle set. Idols players are going to continuously go up in value. So if I were you, definitely scope out Manu. If you have enough MT to invest in Manu Ginobili, I would say do so because he'll definitely rise up in value for sure. Um, let me think. We got other players. So like I said, Kristaps definitely an investment. But for now... For the guys who don't have a lot of MT, man, Amethyst 20 is definitely the, the method for you guys, man. This filter has been making me big money. Um, pretty much got all my MT, like 17k hard, and I really want to buy that. But I'm going to wait. Maybe we'll get some more snipes. I'm trying to get as much investments together as I can. I did spend uh, 400,000 MT on packs. Um, not on this account, but on a PS4 account. So it was rough, man. The pack odds are really bad. And I'm kind of upset about that because I could have bought a stacked account with all that MT I spent. So don't pop in any packs. I really recommend you don't. Ooh. 
Oh, that's gone. Wow, man. You see these snipes, man. Amethyst 20 filters going crazy right now. Especially Curry, LeBron James, um, Giannis. There's just so many snipes going around. Make sure to stay on some of these filters. Like Warriors filter, Lakers filter, Bucks filter. It's a money move, man. If you could get some Lakers play. Ooh. Ooh, that's a huge snipe. We missed that too. No, no way, man. You see that snipe? I don't know how he missed that snipe. Someone's definitely sitting on the Lakers filter, man. There's a lot of snipes to be going around right now. And we missed two, three snipes on this video. There's a lot going on, man, with this whole Lakers filter. And the auction house glitch, man, is absolutely ridiculous. I don't know what's going on with this auction house glitch, but it's seriously ruining ruining 2k right now man it's freaking irritating as hell um so let me think i'm at this 20 is definitely gonna be your best filter what was the new ruby we got brian scalabrine and packs if you guys want man the ruby filter should be going crazy right now like brian scalabrine for 1400 i'm probably gonna buy a couple of these bad boys right here because you're gonna make a lot of mt and of course we can't even buy any of them uh we're gonna make a lot of mt off this brian scalabrine he's honestly a very good card He's definitely a great budget baller card. So if I were you, if you guys want to invest, he has an 86 three-point shot, man. Decent defense. This card's definitely going to go up in value. So I would try to pick up as many Brian Scalabrines as you can. I'm probably going to pick up like 20 to 30. I should be able to double my profit. That's the plan, man. Um, definitely try it out. I'm trying to pick up as many as I can, but the auction house glitch is going crazy right now. Just continuously re refresh this filter. If you guys have like... 50k mt to invest man i would definitely invest in this brian scalabrine man he's gonna be one of your best investments for the low value um definitely should make a lot of mt on this brian scalabrine man he's gonna be very very good for a bunch of ballers man not only that we got boris dial and packs let's check out his value also an amazing budget card who could shoot threes so let's check out his value i know i just sold a couple on ps4 for 8k um on xbox it looks like he's definitely going up i also sold a couple of them for like 30k this boris dial card is definitely going to be a top budget baller card in the game and on xbox he's going for around 17,000 mc so uh let's see man maybe we get a couple snipes i think his price will continue to drop because uh this card's very pullable he's not rare whatsoever oh oh my god bro what's good with these snipes how am i missing these bro so we just missed another snipe. Boris Diaw, man. Definitely a card you want to pay attention to. Um, Auction House Glitch is still out here, man. It's freaking annoying as hell. But uh, we just missed a snipe on Boris Diaw. Definitely scope out his price here and there. But to be honest with you guys, I think the best filter to this day is going to be Amethyst 20, man. No one, Nothing could beat it. Um, there's going to be a lot of movement on this filter. People are kind of scared. They're trying to get rid of all their cards. And by getting rid of LeBron's and AD's and Curry's for the low, you definitely want to be on this filter, man. People are messing up, throwing their Curry's, their AD's. Curry, AD, LeBron, and Giannis have a lot of value. So if you guys want, pick up as many as possible. Not only that, they're cheap amethysts. And they, a lot of them do have playoff awards. So they're also good for unlimited. And uh, let's go over Giannis. Let's see how much Giannis is going for. And I'll, I know a lot of people do love Giannis in this game. So uh, let's check his value. I believe he's dropping down in price like crazy. And he definitely is one of the best centers, power forwards in the game with the 6'11 height and the crazy athleticism. So I definitely think his price will drop. I think he's definitely worth an investment as well. But uh, people keep throwing up Curry snipes. I don't know why, but Curry's definitely a person to monitor right now. Um, not only that, he's very good. I, I played with Curry a couple times and I think he's a very good point guard. He can shoot threes like a god and um, definitely monitor his price. I think I might have to scoop that for 25k. He was going for 36,000 MT yesterday. I did sell mine for 36,000 MT yesterday. Um, like I said, man, my top investments, I got to say Mono Ginobili, Kristaps Porzingis. Uh, if you can get Curry for cheap, definitely Kristaps and definitely Manu, man. Manu's in a lock and set and Kristaps Porzingis is the only center in the game that's stretched. So that's what I think. As you guys can see, that snipe on Kristaps for 33k is already going pretty solidly. So definitely scoop yourself up, Kristaps. Uh, monitor a bunch of prices. Just move around a lot. Don't really stay on one filter. That's not how you're going to make MT. You want to move around a lot 
And yeah, that's really all we got for the video, man. I hope you guys did enjoy. Make MT with these methods. Let me know how it goes. Other than that, man, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.